how to take attendance using Olico's reporting tool. To start, you'll go to learn.olico.org forward slash reports, and then you'll log in with your admin account. Once you log in, in the left-hand side, you'll see our menu items and you'll go down to the attendance section. Now, before you can take attendance for your learners, you need to create attendance sessions for them to be attending. So the first thing you're going to do is click on add sessions. You're then going to select which date range or particular uh, topic area it's going to be. So if it's term one or term three or the go to sessions, you, you select term one and then you select your group of learners that you want to create attendance sessions for. So if you haven't done this before, you'll see there will be no records to show here yet. And what you're going to do then is you're going to add sessions. You can add sessions one by one. I'm going to demonstrate how we would add sessions across the whole term in bulk. So I'm going to click on bulk add. I'm going to select, we can make sure we're in the correct category here. So term one, demo learners. We're going to put down what the date range is for term one, um, which is uh, from 11 January to 31 March. We're going to enter a session time, which is going to be the, uh, let's say the learners arrive at our uh, session start at three o'clock and they happen on a Tuesday and a Thursday and that happens every week. It's going to give us a, a brief preview of what we've selected here. These are all the sessions that will be created once we're ready. Uh, and then we just click save. Once we've clicked save, if we go back here, we can see under the sessions tab here, all of the sessions that we've now created, which we will now be able to use to take attendance of our learners against. So to actually take attendance, we're going to click on take attendance in the left hand side. We're going to select which term we want to do. So it's 2023 term one. We select our cohort. It's our demo learners. There's 46 sessions that were created um, in this term. Um, and uh, then we're going to select whichever date we're taking attendance for. So let's assume that today is the 12th of January. It's Thursday at three o'clock. The learners have started to arrive and it will create, give us a list of all the learners' names, all their surnames, their first names, and then we'll be able to mark them either as present, late, excused, or absent. You'll see, just to make sure that the server is receiving our input, uh, you'll get a little green tick once we've done that, and you can uh, mark the learners as present, uh, absent, excused, and that, in a nutshell, is how you take attendance. Once you've done, you don't need to save or anything. It will update the server as you're uh, updating their attendance status. Um, and then once you're done, you'll be able to go through any of these reports on the left-hand side here, which I will leave for you to look at, at in your own time.